Okay, so I'm going to show you the lizard and then the robot. And they look very similar, and I don't think it particularly matters. You just go with what either your therapist has told you or where you guys are at, because some are a little more complicated than others. So, you start with the face on the floor. Your arms at your sides and your, your legs down, okay? You turn to one direction, so right now I'm turning to the left. I keep my hand in contact with the ground and I go with my thumb towards my nose and then I bring up my leg. I rest there for three seconds. Then I turn my head the opposite direction and then I'll move my leg and then my arm. So one, two, three. My leg will go down, my arm will go down, and I'll wait three seconds. Then I'll bring my arm up on the right my leg up on the right. I wait three seconds. I then turn my head to the opposite. I wait three seconds. I put my leg down. I put my arm down. So that would be the basics. You can start to get a little bit fancier. You can do it at the same time. So arm and leg at the same time. Wait for that pause. Turn. Arm and leg at the same time. Arm and leg at the same time, wait three seconds, and then switch. You can get a little bit fancier than that, so I can be here, and I can wait it out, and I can go here, down, and then I can switch. And then I can go here, and then I can switch. That gets a little bit fancier, but you gotta just be comfortable with it. So that is basically the lizard. You can also do the robot. It's just a little bit more mechanical looking, hence the robot. So you throw the head down, legs down, the head towards the left. The leg goes up first, then the arm. Then you'd wait that same three seconds. You turn. You'd put the hand down, the leg down, leg up, arm up. Wait three seconds and switch. Arm down, leg down, leg up, arm up. So it looks very, very similar, just a little bit more robotic, hence the robot versus the lizard.